My name is Jillian Hayde. I interned with ChefGig in January. I was hired as a full-time data scientist in April. Um, I found my data science career kind of through a winding path. Um, my background is actually in environmental science and I have a friend who is an experienced designer and I was telling her that I was kind of feeling a little stale at my job and I wanted to do more. I wanted to use a lot more of my math and science backgrounds um, practically and she told me about uh, some classes that she had taken so I looked over the different course offerings and I saw data science. As I read it uh, it made the most sense to me because it was all uh, statistics and math. So basically I took an immersive course for three months and I learned how to code. Um, but it really taught us how to use uh, our scientific background and apply it to machine learning. Day to day for me is uh, we have a lot of meetings. We are really big on communication. So we'll have meetings to plan out what we're going to do, who we should talk to, what stakeholders need to be involved. And then after that, we'll start formulating our plan on how to break up the work. We try and grab some of the low hanging fruit. Uh, not everything is gonna lead to the best predictive model. So some of our more analytical work can be just as impactful as our predictions. I believe a good data scientist is qualitative as well as quantitative. I think asking the right questions and sometimes asking the wrong questions can be just as helpful. Knowing what is going on with the data and wondering why it's happening can lead to some really good answers. Also, I think an important quality is knowing when good enough is just good enough. As data scientists, we can tend to be perfectionists, and sometimes that 98% accuracy isn't exactly what you need. Sometimes 86, 94 is just as good. Outside of work, I spend a lot of time with my dog, Duke. So we go to the park. I like being outside. Chicago is great three months out of the year, so you really take advantage of that time. Uh, other than that, uh, I do go to a lot of meetups for data science in my free time too. It's important for women in technology to have the confidence that they have just as much right to be there as anyone else. I think some of the deterrent for women in tech is the, the stereotype that you, you know, you've been coding since birth or you know you grew up on computers and you already know what you're doing. I've been coding for a year now so I think I'm a pretty good example of how that isn't true. Uh, I don't live and breathe computers. You know I do a lot of stuff outside of the office on weekends uh, but I do like to stay up to date on what's going on in the tech scene and I think Chicago's growing tech scene is really important and really big right now.